Hey, good afternoon my friends. How are you guys doing? Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Crystal Randomized Marslock. My name is Frank and I hope you are having a good day, dudes. I truly do, you know. Today we're doing Route 45, so we have an encounter, we have some traders, and we get the team ready for the... Um, what's called? The Victory Road, huh? So that's gonna be nice. That's the plan for today. Hope you are excited. Let's have a look at the team preview. Once again, you as always. Let's see what we got. We got the Baltrus almost leveled up to level 35. Nice. We got Taurus, level 35. Very cool. We got Blastoise too. What a what a big guy, huh? What a great Pokemon. Tyranitar. Yeah, this is quite a team, isn't it? Then we got the Zapdos. And then, finally, we got the Dugong. Right here, you know, a little bit uh, of ice coverage. Nothing bad at all, but uh, we'll see how everything continues, right? Depending on the encounters we get, if we want to trade something else or not. Uh, but we'll see, you know. Uh, but I am excited to continue this. Uh, there was a one week hiatus, well not week, but there was a, a little bit of a hiatus. Um, regarding this, is this, this a cave here? I didn't know. Uh, because I started the Elden Ring DLC. So, and I'm still playing it. So we, got, we got the Dark Cave. I don't think we already have something here. We don't need to be here. Um, so, I guess we can go different paths, right? Uh, I guess we start first to the right, and then we see, right? So we can get an encounter here quick. And the encounter is... Ooh! Nice, dude. I love Ampharos. That is a great substitute for Zapdos if something happens. Okay. Not bad at all. Oops. Sorry. Clicked outside. Didn't mean to, huh? Alright, now my attack is lower, which is perfect, right? Because we can go for this strength. It shouldn't kill. Everyone loves Ampharos, right? Okay. I should have some balls here. Quite a bit of balls, huh? I love... Yeah. Oh, no, wait. Ultra Ball fits the color scheme of Ampharos. Yeah, it's yellow. We gotta use it. <laughs> Did we get it? Oh, baby, baby, baby! Ampharos on the tip. Well, not on the team, but caught. Ampharos, light. When it gets dark, the light from its bright, shiny tail can be seen from far away on the ocean surface. Yeah. They use this Pokemon as a, as a slave, you know, as a lighthouse. How do I call you? You know, you're supposed to be an evolution of a sheep, a dragon sheep in the end. Uh, but I don't know how to name you, to be honest. We'll name you Baldy. Because you had no hair. There we go. To Bill's PC. What? Alright. Bye now. Yeah, fair enough. We need to change this. I hope I remember, man. Because I'm the I'm the kind of guy that, that will forget, you know. But we have a trader. What are your thoughts on raising Pokemon? <laughs> what kind of question is that? It reminds me a little bit of an exaggerated question, right? But uh, or similitude, uh, or similarity, I should say. Because um, there's like when the doctor disrespect situation happened, right? there was a lot of people asking streamers. Um, what do they think of that situation, right? And what is, to be honest, what it is to say, right? Pedophilia is bad? <laughs> I thought that was obvious. Some weird things that happen to the internet. I wonder why they like talking to children so much. <laughs> Anyways. We're gonna have a double level up for you guys. Just to see that- oh, maybe not. Just to see that we don't like pedophilia, but... 
We did not get it, so... Take that as you will. Damn! Oh! I'm getting imbued! I love that it keeps the, the, the Mew color, man. They should keep, do, keep doing this in the newer games, to be honest. Oh, I got a crit. Lol. They, so, they should absolutely do it. That d turn Mew, after using Transform, keep their boof set. Isn't that crazy? Alright. Well, we'll go on train it down. Okay, now we are around here. I guess we could see what other encounters we could have had. See, there's an item we can get next time. That's fine, you know. Maybe there's a horsey. Don't we already have a horsey? It's level 30 though. It's not bad actually. That would have been a decent encounter. Okay, so next we go... Uh, to the right. Uh, to the left, sorry. Maybe there's something here. There we go. Yeah, so you have to do this two times on this different. Oh, Dawn Smash would have been fun. Well, no, it's a trash Pokemon, but it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> Not like I'm using a super fun team, uh, regardless, but. Are you removing my shit? Bro. It's very rude. Perfect. What do we got here, huh? Amulet coin? Do we even have one? I think I already have an amulet coin. I don't really need it, to be honest, but... I don't have it. But this does something, right? How about this? Upgrade doesn't do anything. I'm gonna toss that shit. Yay. Will I need money? Probably not, but... Um, whatever. What is your battle strategy? It is foolish to use strong moves indiscriminately. I guess she's talking about the... Kind of just balance check of the stronger boobs, right? Missing. Perchance. Like, about the strongest boobs always have some sort of, like, effect, right? That it's negative. Not full accuracy, uh, make you rest another turn after. Supposedly she's talking about that, but depending on the Pokemon you use. It's probably a legit tactic anyways. <laughs> These guys have, have not high level Pokemon, I must say. I guess that's, that's how the game works, right? That's how Pokemon Gold, Silver and Crystal work, but still. It's a weird game, I wonder what the decision was for this. If there was much a decision, to be honest. Maybe they were like, people is stupid. We need to make the games easier. <laughs> Nowadays, things have changed quite a bit though. Video games are full mainstream media now. And there's, there's people getting very good at Pokemon. Apart from uh, many other games. Like, if you see the craziest Nuzlockers around, they do pretty insane challenges. Me, I'm just here to chill, right? Not much of a full NOS locker myself, but every now and then you guys are like, you know, you guys know I do my playthroughs, and I'm glad you guys enjoyed it, you know? Especially watching in the future is interesting. Quite a lot of people watch us years on this Let's Play, it's fun. I was training here alone. Behold the fruits of my labor. But anyways, <laughs> love video games to be honest, and I'm, you know, I'm glad you guys are enjoying the channels. It's fun. It's something about it that sometimes you want to play games, but sometimes you just want to play for hours. I want to 
that makes sense. Not everyone has that, of course, but... You know, during my workday, I, I work from home, so... Most of the... I watch a lot of, like, playthroughs and stuff like that, because... It's something to have as, as a background, right, to be watching while doing some of the work, or, like, waiting... For some work to do, right? Like, right now, I'm technically working. <laughs> but I've already finished my job for today very efficiently. Um, which doesn't mean I am wanting to do any sort of extra work. So that's why I'm not saying anything. <laughs> and it's pretty close to the, the end of the day anyways. So, I'm recording this. Make better use of my time, the things that I enjoy. Well, I already did my job, you know? That's how we do it. If they call me though, or they need anything, then I'll have to answer and pause this, this playthrough. Until then, not gonna happen. <laughs> Working from home though has given me some nice opportunities, not gonna lie. You know, be able to dedicate myself better to content creation, which I like. Nothing professional, but still, you know, have more time for that. Um, be able to live in a non such expensive place like in Barcelona, so you can go to other areas, much beautiful, healthy areas with beautiful landscapes while I work. And they're much, much less expensive too. What? That's kind of weird. Whatever, we'll beat him. And yeah, only advantages, man. Um, since I do my job, no one's complaining. In fact, I got a promotion. I uh, didn't talk about it anywhere yet, but uh, I got a little promotion. Um, so I'm gonna get a little bit more money and a career plan. So they finally trust me. <laughs> they finally trust me to stay in the company and everything. Since oh my god, that was a thunder. Okay. <laughs> what do I do against that? You may hear it in the background. But I don't have like s nice switchings. I guess this, but it's not a switching for anything. So I wanted to switch something to heat it. Oh, okay. I'm not sure if the mic's picking up the thunder sounds, but it is pretty incredible. We. <sighs> Confusion over. Oh, nice. Very nice. Right, there's a Stadler. Would be good to stay, but honestly, I don't like the confusion here. So, we're gonna go into our nice, normal type resist. And we do have a pretty solid team. I think we can work with it until the end game. And not suffer, you know. Or not suffer much. So glad I have this cross chop TMs randomized. Too. I'm giving the game a little spice, you know. And last Pokemon is going to be a Salami. Alright. I don't really have a Dark Room, so I think I'm gonna swap. Um, I guess Moltres is pretty good. Has some powerful flying moves. No, no. I'm already receiving notifications, but it's just, you know, work notifications. I'm okay. <laughs> They're not for me. I never realized how long this animation is. Push. And the fly animation is really simple. You wouldn't think of it, but... Enemy shall be for short attack, too late. And same goes for wing attack. Nothing really makes you think it's a wing attack apart from the sound, right? Image-wise or animation-wise. But the sound does. So that is interesting, I guess. All right, I think we wanted to go here first, right? Go to the right first. Yeah, we want to go to the right first. What is this? A uh, what? Mystery berry? That sounds interesting. 
probably not very good, but... God, I have so much of this items that are weird. <laughs> Proof of Steel type moves. Hmm. A lot of, a lot of good stuff. Do I have to toss the amulet again? That's kind of lame. Firestone? No. And the pink bow? No. Three miracle seeds. The items could be useful, but... I think Tauros already has a normal boosting item, so we're just gonna toss this. And if not, I'll cry. I just wanna see what this mystery bear is all about. What the hell is a mystery berry? Self restore for PP. Ah, oh, curious. Alright. So that's the first step for this route, I think. What is this? Route 46. We'll do this next time. So now we just fly back. Yeah, exactly. To this Blackthorn city, and we do the route, but from the other side, so we can pick perhaps the items that we're missing, as well as um, f have enough time to finish the episode. I guess I'm gonna do the box stuff though. Let's PC. Change box. This one is full. I'm gonna put box two. Thank God I remembered. All right. And we could go fast, so we don't spend much time in this. <laughs> oh my god, that was so close, I saw that shit. Right, now, we <laughs> all the birds are flying away scared. <laughs> Pussy ass birds. I love thunders. Calcium, nice. So this, this item limitations, huh? kinda cringe. I'm gonna give this to someone. Someone who has few PP, like the root. Doesn't have an item. Maybe I'll make use of it. Who knows? Calcium! Let's go. And now we fight this guy. Alright, here we go. War Turtle shouldn't be much of a problem. It distracted me with notifications of something that is not my thing. Okay, here we go, almost level 35. There we go, and I think we have a trader here as well. Oh, maybe not. And she's the one of the super powerful buffs. Facts. Mm-hmm. Another Ampharos. I guess we could just use the Ruid. Once again. Not very effective. We're eating those. That should be no problem. Why are the levels so long? There has to be like a Crystal Redux version. We could try those someday. Maybe. Alright, everyone's level 35 now, okay. Blastoise to the front. Since he's the leader of the team, I guess. Since most of the, the starting team has died. Potion Cure Berry, no need. Okay. We're doing it, you know. Slowly doing it, okay. We're now here, there's another item down here. There's a pink bow. <laughs> That's like the item I throw. That's kind of funny. 
All right, that was quite easy, to be honest. I guess we could do next route, right? Route 46. Uh, there is two paths to this route, I guess, too. Um, so I don't know what path I want to take, right? I just, yeah. So route 46. There's an encounter here. So if we go down, I think this is the we call back to the beginning, right? Let me see the map here. Yes, so I don't think we want to go down. We may already have an encounter for this run. There's some little trees here. Potion cure, paralyzed cure berry, okay. It's just a berry, okay. <laughs> so I think we want to go this way. Yeah, there we go. A couple of traders to finish the episode. And raise your Pokemon too. And they have a spear off. <laughs> Level? 17! What? Man, I don't get this, people. This game is crazy. I love it, though. But... There's something about playing it, looking at the graphics, right? All of that. That just feels fantastic. Maybe I'm the only one thinking this, but I doubt it. I think there's a lot of people who likes the first and second generation games, despite how old and fucked up they are. Alright, well this should be pretty easy, regardless. Nice. Easy peasy. Level 16, who could have thought that this could be such a threat? But the experience is juicy. I wonder if Blasters will learn a move now that it reaches level 36, which is the evolution level. It may, actually. Soon enough, and the last item we can grab is a tiny mushroom. Wow. And I think now we come back to the beginning, right? There should be Pokemon on level 3. Drio, Drio, Drio. Indeed. <laughs> Level 2. <laughs> no Arena Trap. Could you imagine this dog tree is so weak? Arena Trap doesn't even work on them. <laughs> Alright. And the last things we gotta do... Uh, is just finish, right? Uh, go to the next steps. Here, now that we have Waterfall. We just have to go to Route 27. Now from the, from the main town, right? I think we can actually go by foot. Should be okay with it. Ah, oh, this music. All the memories we had from this playthrough. When Houndoom was still alive, you know? Great memories. Now they're just dead. Literally. I'm gonna use this final super repel. Just go through the route. Quick. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I forgot the route. Incredible. I think we should be able to pass through here. New bog town. That's fine. Mm -mm. And then we surf. I'm pretty sure we will be on our way to the next uh, route. Pretty sure I already spoke to these people during this playthrough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We Gucci, brother. Yeah. So... We already did the Tojo Falls, but uh, now we have to actually do them, you know? And we'll do this next time, you know? I hope you have enjoyed this episode. Um, no, going to the the final steps of this challenge, and the playthrough is about to come to an end, which is exciting every time, you know. And we have a lot of playthroughs to continue, so nothing new to do until then. So I hope you have enjoyed today's um, episode, you know, part of the playthrough. And I'll see you guys next time, my friends. Goodbye. <laughs>